hello guys welcome to another video in this video we'll learn about the classification of propagation there are mainly two classification of propagation first one is sexual propagation which is caused by seed and second one is asexual propagation or vegetative propagation we know that sexual propagation is caused by seed and asexual propagation uh, further more classify into uh, grafting, budding, cutting, layering, separation, division, micro, micro propagation, apomixis and many more. Uh, in this video we will learn one by one of this propagation. So let's get started. First one is sexual propagation. Sexual propagation of plant. In this method plant propagation is done through seeds it is also known as seed propagation seeds are produced thus by sexual uh, reproduction in fruits of the plants a plant grown from seed may have different characteristics than its parent tree some plants may not have seeds here in the picture we can see the sexual propagation that is formation of seed and uh, germination of uh, seed so this is the process of uh, sexual propagation now we are going to learn about the asex different types of asexual propagation such as uh, uh, apomictic embryo or apomixis this is this is an example of asexual propagation so apomixis is the replacement of as uh, sexual reproduction by asexual reproduction without fertilization without fertilization apomictic embryos in citrus arise from ma maternal sporophytic tissue in the ovule. Citrus will usually have polyembryonic feature where more than a single embryo are produced. Apomixis is a form of asexual reproduction where in the seed carries the embryo that is clone of the uh, deployed maternal parent plant instead of a sexual hybrid embryo resulting from a fusion of gametes. Here in the picture we can see that uh, first picture is the sexual progeny and the uh, uh, second picture is apomixis which is uh, which occurs without fertilization here you can see in the picture without fertilization um, sexual uh, um, uh, sexual propagation is occurs as, uh, which is known as ap apomixis without fertilization then runners it is another type of uh, asexual propagation in botany a stolon also called a runner is slender stem that grows horizontally along the gr ground giving rise to roots and aerial vertical branches at specialized points called nodes in the picture we can see that runners um, propagation of runners uh, this is called stolon or runners and uh, we can see that new plant arise from the runners so this is uh, known as uh, uh, asexual propagation by runners then next is uh, propagation is sucker sucker is also a, an asexual propagation another type of asexual propagation uh, suckering serves such as uh, aronia bay sarcoco sarco cocca and species roses can send up new shoots or suckers from their roots uh, removing and growing on these shoots with roots at their base is an easy and low cost way to produce new plants such as a banana we can see this is the sucker this is the sucker produced from the uh, side of root uh, uh, and uh, uh, this is the process of asex uh, asexual sucker propagation process this is sakar then next one is uh, separation separation is another type of asexual propagation whereas in separation the rooted or unrooted parts of the plant uh, detached from the main plant on maturity this start to develop a new plant in the next season many of these plant parts are genetic modification of stems meant for vegetative propagation only uh, separation uh, may be classified into three types. First one is bulbs, example onion, garlic, e e example corms, and uh, 
sorry uh, bulbs example onion and garlic second uh, ex second is corns example uh, arrowheads and gradiolas and third example uh, is slip uh, pineapple here in the picture we can see that uh, uh, figure of onion and the uh, uh, this is the attached bulbs and uh, in the next picture we can see and uh, the bulbs um, uh, grow grow independently so this is called separation and the next one is division division is another type of asexual propagation division is a simple means of vegetative propagation for plants that produce suckers stolons buds tubers or rhizomes to propagate by division dig up the plant and divide it carefully using a spade or sketchers division may classified into uh, stem tubers tuberous roots rhizomes crowns and offset stem tubers example is potato tuberous roots example sweet potato dahlia rhizomes example ginger turmeric and crown example pineapple and offset example pineapple date here is the picture you can see that um, different type of division and this division uh, may grow into a, a new plants so this is the process of division or asexual propagation by division next propagation is cutting cutting is an another type of asexual propagation a cutting is a section of plants such as a modified stem leaf or root used for vegetative propagation that forms either advent adventitious roots or adventitious uh, roots stem single node or both uh, cutting may be classified into stem cutting root cutting leaf cutting and leaf bud cutting uh, stem cutting example are grape rose uh, root cutting example are apple guava leaf cutting example lemon uh, bryophyllum or pathor kuchi then uh, next leaf bud cutting example is pineapple tea here in the picture we can see that cutting uh, with blade and this cutting uh, independently uh, can grow into a plant so this is the process of uh, uh, cutting in the next um, the next uh, propagation process is layering layering is another type of asexual propagation layering is a technique of plant propagation where uh, the new plant remains at least partially attached to the mother plant while forming new roots and uh, uh, can occur naturally through modified stem uh, structures um, layering may be classified into tip layering simple layering compound layering moon layering and air layering uh, example of tip layering are um, uh, pa purple and black raspberries uh, blackberries etc simple layering example are honeysuckle spider plant etc compound layering example heart leaf uh, philodendron pothos etc moon layering example gooseberries apple rootstocks etc air layering such as citrus guava lychee here we can see in the figure different types of layering this is called uh, moon layering and this is uh, air layering process of air layering so this is the process of air layering or asexual propagation next on is um, grafting grafting is another type of uh, asexual propagation grafting is a method uh, of asexual plant propagation that joins plant parts from different plants together so they will heal and grow as on plant and here are different types of grafting such as whip and tongue grafting cleft grafting vineyard grafting side grafting etc a uh, mango is an uh, common example for gra grafting here we can see uh, different types of grafting and um, such as wh whip and tongue grafting uh, uh, then crown grafting side grafting etc and the uh, uh, next one is budding budding is an another type of um, asexual propagation P uh, propagation by budding is a pretty common method of plant propagation in which a plant bud is grafted onto the stem of a rootstock plant budding may be classified into different types such as tea budding or seed budding patch budding uh, ring budding chip budding and eye budding tea budding um, 
example is rose, citrus, patch budding example jujube, guava, ring budding example jujube, chip budding example guava and eye budding citrus. Here in, is the process of budding. Uh, uh, is, this is the process of cutting up scion and uh, th uh, this is rootstock and uh, scion is uh, inserted into rootstock and binding together. This is called uh, budding. Then another uh, uh, micro propagation is another uh, asexual propagation. Uh, micro propagation is a method of plant propagation using extremely small pieces of plant tissue take, taken from a carefully chosen and prepared mother plant and growing this under laboratory conditions to produce new plants. This is the process of micro propagation such as uh, 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 nutrient media and uh, uh, first step is nutrient media and uh, uh, a plant tissue or explant is inserted in nutrient media then callus formation then shoot and root development and then transplantation so this is the process of uh, micro propagation so these are the uh, asexual propagation uh, that's all for today we'll learn uh, more about uh, the propagation in the next video thanks for watching